But on a serious note, I think I am quitting YouTube. Yo, gang, what is the deal? Now, if y'all don't know who I am, I, you're... Yo, gang, what is the deal? Now, if you don't know who I am, you know what I'm saying? If you're new to the channel, my name is eBay, man. The last video, we did about the five reasons why I hate my car. It got, like, damn near 700 views, you know what I'm saying? So, we got to come back with the why do I like my car. My car might be a little loud because it is just, again, a little cold start. I ain't get that on camera, though, but, uh, <sighs> look at that. Look how cold it is. Y'all can't even see, but, man. We finna go to the little car wash, we finna shoot this, gonna say, gonna let the big baby warm up, you know what I'm saying? But we finna get this video cranked out, and I'm super excited to go into the new year. New years, new goals, time to manifest, you get what I'm saying? Time to put all this plan aside, perfect your craft. My last video was a Christmas video, so if you had a nice Christmas out there, you know what I'm saying? Just to be here is a gift, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, but on a serious note, I think I am quitting YouTube. Until next year. <laughs> but man, today is the 29th, man. So um so yeah. We're gonna get this started. Gang, it is so cold out here, but y'all see the baby. You see the beast. Now I don't got no name for my car yet. So y'all gotta help me pick a name, you know what I'm saying? So that go down in the comments if you, if you got something you know what i'm saying you think it'll go good with my car you know what i'm saying look at it i just washed the car last night man no cap it's already it's just as high as it's gonna be in the winter we still got some snow well, not snow but like little ice or whatever you know what i'm saying but jeez man she do look good so before this video even gets started man shout out to my boy todd my boy Ty on snapchat came through last night and bought my last large shirt now i got one more shirt left this shirt drop is going to be it. I'm not dropping these shirts no more. So I got one more extra large shirt. Come get it. But look look how cold it is, man. 27 degrees. Freeze. It's 27 degrees. Now I'm out here trying to bang a video. My hands are already getting cold. So we're going to be five reasons why I like my 2007 Christ 300C 5.7 Hemi. You know what I'm saying? So let's get into it. One reason why I like my car so much is my headlights. These aftermarket headlights. So if y'all don't know, a couple of videos back, my boy T ended up buying these headlights for himself. They didn't end up working for some reason, but they worked on my car. So we got the headlights, the LED bar. That bulb is kind of yellow, so we're going to get a blue bulb real soon. But I'm going to turn it on for y'all. And this how it looks. It looks way better at nighttime, but it, on the camera, it looks so good. I ain't going to lie. Nah, I wanted to... Just switch my, I'm going to get new tail light soon. I'm going to spoil that. Look at the, let me get this together, man. Now, if y'all always in my videos saying why my hands be so, you know what I'm saying, ashy. So I'll be just getting out the shower. I'll be forgetting to put on lotion, but it's so cold out there. I had to get back in the car for a second, but I'm going to turn back on in one second. All right, gang, back to the headlights. So, yeah, basically I was saying my boy T ended up selling me these. You see the LED, but we're going to get the ball back. I already kind of told y'all. I don't know where I left off at. Cause it's freezing out here. Boy, just had to get back inside the car. But, uh, he got a little hemi. But, uh, number two, the SRT rims. You get what I'm saying? Look at that. Look how, you get what I'm saying? It's only dirty because, man, it just won't stay clean. Y'all know the weather. Look at the snow on the ground. I'm in Michigan, so... That's how the cash is how it is, man. But the SRT rims was a big. How can I say this? The SRT rims was a big, like level I that came across. I just seen the old video of my car with the old rims. The shit looked it terrible, man. I ain't gonna lie. Like I don't know how I went that long driving on them ugly ass rims. I, I ain't even gonna be fake to y'all. I'm gonna keep it real. But. Never again will I, you know what I'm saying? Hell no. Them rims was garbage. No cap. But, uh, so that's number two. All right, so the third thing. All right, so the third thing I like about my car is the motor. We're going to pop this for y'all. No cap is the motor. But you pay for this car. You get know what I'm saying? That basic both on mods. You get a hella. Damn, can I get it? Would you get like the power wise out the five seven Hemi with like a basic Botox? All I got done in my cart is 
uh, air intake, heating and air intake, 180 degree thermostat. Now in the comments, don't say I'm not stopped because air, I mean, in the air intake, you have a little bit more air, but the thermostat is going to make the car run cooler. You get what I'm saying? It don't make it faster. Don't increase horsepower. Just make the car run better. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, y'all might get on my ass because you get what I'm saying? It looks a little dusty down there, a little dirty, but just the power you get from a 5.7 Hemi for the price is crazy. And my, it come out with like, what is it, like 340 horsepower? I'm not too sure how much torque it got, but come like 340 horsepower, bare bone. So that probably added like 10, maybe 15. The thermostat, like I said, didn't add nothing. You know what I'm saying? All factory. Somebody calling me. But yeah, man. So that's the third thing. Nah, listen. But they, they say you can make a lot of power out the 5.7 Hemi. And this is a five speed. So the 5.7, five speed, first gen, Chrysler 300C. I just seen these boys, 426, uh, Pro Charge, everything, you know what I'm saying? So if you got the money, you can get these boys real wicked and it'll be a sleeper. They think like, look at this, they'd be like, look at this old car. For the right budget bill, you could push some serious horsepower, no cap. But uh, this, with this little budget bill I got, I, I done took over some, some second gens. I ain't gonna put no names out there, but I done took over some second gens, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, but yeah, gang. Uh, okay, gang, for the fourth thing I like about my car is the miles per gallon. Uh, by being stock with um, minor mods, you know what I'm saying? I don't know how much it come like factory, but I'm having on the screen for y'all. But man, I, I race a little bit. I have a little bit of fun when I'm with the guys, when I'm with the gang. But I pretty much don't do too much to drive in the city. And uh, I probably go like a full tank in a week. So for me at least, the miles per gallon on this car is awesome. I ain't gonna lie. I don't really do too much, you know what I'm saying? So. The miles per gallon, it's, it's a V8, so it's all about how you drive. Not even just a V8, any car, a V6, a four cylinder, a damn mini bike. The crazier you drive it, the more gas you get, what I'm saying. But this is a V8, it's gonna burn a little more, but uh, yeah, so that's about it. So the miles per gallon on my car is pretty good, I can't lie. I throw a quick dub in the tank, quick 20 bar. I ain't gonna lie, that put me at like a half a tank, man. She's look, look how look how good she looked, man. I ain't gonna lie. Just, you, you see how dirty? Look at that. Look at the little dirt, man. But like I'm saying, it's the Michigan weather. But so on number one, we got on the list is the so so far, guys. We got the wheels. We got the the five seven Hemi. You know what I'm saying? We got the miles per gallon, and we got one more, man. Uh, in the headlights so those are the four things that i like about my car and now we got one more we ain't gonna figure out the last one we got one more that i love about my car man no cap now this car has been nothing but good to me we had a little motor work in the front that needed to be fixed but man any used car you're gonna buy gonna have a problem that's just something you got to deal with and just hope you don't buy a damn a ticket time bombs on the, on wheels like my boy t-baby did Big lifted truck, man. Oh, he turbo diesel too, man. But I need my boy Mark to help me. We need Mark or T. You know what I'm saying? We need somebody to help me. We need one more thing. I don't know what the hell Mark doing. Let, let's see. Uh, let's see if T work. Let's see if T work, guys. All right, now I ain't gonna lie. My mama. T baby and mine is all cut off. I'm trying to ask you, I'm trying to get them on the video for a second to let me know. I need one more thing, but I think I just got it. Uh this is gonna be I got blue LED lights, like in the uh dome lights, uh the door lights. Let's see if I can turn them on for y'all. You see, oh right there, that's one. Got them right here, got them down there. Got them right there, y'all can't really see that, but but yeah. When I first bought this car, you know what I'm saying? The first time I drive it at night, open the door, all I seen was like this, all this shit was like yellow lights. I'm like, hell no, 
that looks so terrible, but we put the blue lights in. I got them off eBay for like um, 20 bucks, but man, that was a big upgrade. That shit looked is so terrible. They was like white as yellow. Like I don't think I got the video to show y'all like how it looked, but when I tell y'all, it was like the worst white yellow is. You get what I'm saying? I think the camera a little crooked, but but yeah. Uh, then more the five reasons. So we got the headlights, we got the rims, we got the blue LED lights right here, we got the gas mileage, and we got the power. Just the power you can get out of a stock 5.7 Hemi is crazy. Without going internal, it's crazy. You get them? I was going to leave the car stock, you get what I'm saying? Until, uh, like, for the last summer, it was just going to be stock, you know what I'm saying? Just get around, you know what I'm saying? But next summer, we might go tuned. I ain't going to lie. I've been thinking about going E85. We might get some different rims, too. So we might go get a killer E85 tune. Um... Let's see. Hey, we're going to full center. Let's see how much power we can get out this Hemi. They say, I ain't going to lie. I've been seeing these pushing like 460, 470 easy. Like, they say a few Botons, and you, you can compete with an SRT like 300 and charge. You get what I'm saying? Just, y'all got to stay tuned. If y'all want me to go get a tune, y'all want me to go get this and get this, just subscribe right now. Go down there and subscribe. Show me that y'all support me. You get what I'm saying? Because... Whatever I put out and y'all mess with is gonna make him go harder. And you know what I'm saying? All this is coming from the pockets. You know what I'm saying? So we definitely need support, man. Uh, so yeah, so I might be tuned. You know what I'm saying? If y'all want me to get tuned, leave a like right now. Go down there and tell me, leave it. Go get a tune, man. I ain't gonna lie. If we get a tune, we gonna step the racing game up. I got GoPros. I got so much footage. I ain't gonna lie. So uh. I have raced in the past, and I like more of the dig racing. Let me know in the comments if you like dig and on road racing, like 40 to 120. Of course, it's in Mexico. We don't go nowhere but Mexico. You get what I'm saying? So, it would be about a 12-hour drive to Mexico. But anyways, that's outside the point. But this was my five reasons why I like my Chrysler 300C. 2007, 547. Here we get what I'm saying? So, uh... So, yeah, gang, I ain't gonna lie. If you made it this far in the video, comment just the number five. Just the number five. We gonna really see who made it all the way to the end of the video. I ain't gonna lie. Some of y'all be clicking on the video. We can't be having that, gang. But comment the number five if you finish the video all the way through. Now, uh, this video pretty much over. We ain't gonna end it off right now. Your boy needs some gas. Driving V8 Hemi. You gonna have to have gas. You get what I'm saying? So, uh, I I spent so much gas a week now. If y'all want a uh, update video, like about the maintenance, like how much I spent on tires from burnouts, how much I go through gas, oil change cost, just everything. Thing you know what I'm saying now. If you don't know, them 300s and these first gen cars are. Damn, slow down, dude in the Hellcat tripping. But if y'all don't know, the first gen suspension sucks, man. So I ain't even trying to get all the, I ain't trying to get all the, I ain't even trying to get into all that. I need so much front end suspension, you get what I'm saying? But yeah, we gonna start this baby back up, uh, head to the gas station. Uh, that's about it, gang. But yeah, uh, Thanks for rocking with me. Oh, one more thing. I couldn't leave this out. We just hit 3.1K subscribers. I ain't gonna lie. This is crazy, man. If y'all rocking with me, I ain't gonna lie. Like, like, from the bottom of my heart, I didn't think I'd get this big. Not saying I'm big, but... Just, I, I just didn't know. You know what I'm saying? But if you rock with me, dude. Just saying, if you rock with me, man, I ain't gonna lie. It, all the love is appreciated. I swear to God. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie, just it, it's been a tough route. Y'all didn't see me come from the Buick. Now, I was so self conscious about the Buick, I really didn't have too many videos. But my social media people they for sure seen the Buick. So, uh, I your boy came a long way, no cap. Now, I'll be in this, you know what I'm saying? And I was so nervous getting this car because I didn't know what y'all wanted to see. You get what I'm saying? This car was right in the budget. Now, from the looks of it, like y'all love it, no cap. So, uh, yeah, that's that's it's just crazy how uh 
how crazy this turning out for me, bro. But 2021, we ain't let no haters get, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna leave the haters out. We pushing all positive vibes. If you're a part of my game, we pushing positive. I don't know what other people are doing, but you rock with me, you subscribe to me, you know what I'm saying? Pushing all positive vibes, you all gonna make it up to the top just one step at a time, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, this support been crazy. I ain't gonna lie, like every day we getting subscribers, you, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, it's crazy, man. Just if you've been here from the start, you know what I'm saying? And just if you've been here from the start, even if you just subscribe today, you know what I'm saying? Be a part of the journey, cause man. Y'all gotta watch me come from the bottom to the top. Man, I ain't gonna lie. I wanted to bring y'all with me, no cap. But, uh, yeah. Enough of me rambling about just crazy life events. Uh, New Year coming up. Like I'm saying, we gonna take off. But I'm gonna close my little hood. Because I showed y'all up under the car. Up under the, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go close that. We gonna go get gas. We gonna probably end it off right there. We probably gonna do one more thing. I doubt it though, but. I just appreciate y'all so much. And uh like I said, big shout out to my boy Ty for buying the shirt last night, man. Big ups. He told me he was at the Josh Ron meet. Uh he was just a little scared to talk to me. But if you see me out in traffic, don't be scared to talk. You know what I'm saying? I am a human being, you know what I'm saying? If you rock with me, I rock with you no cap. Just uh yeah, he's seen me rocking me since like one thousand subscribers and that's crazy, man. I ain't gonna lie, but I hit 1K. It, it was just crazy. I, I, I ain't gonna keep. I, I ain't trying to keep dragging this, but I really didn't expect too much. You know what I'm saying? The way it just. I don't know, dude. Like, I, I, I just, I, I, I I'm done. But we gonna go to get to the gas station, man. Uh, you gonna see all there. Gang, your boy ended up getting his money at, at home, so we just gonna close this video out right here and there, man. Before we close it out, we just hit another milestone on miles. Guess how many miles I got? I'm gonna give y'all a second to guess, but y'all ready? Watch this. Last night, we just hit 75,000 miles, man. And I ain't gonna lie, this boy's still running like a beast. I haven't, like I said, all you and Scar gonna have certain problems when you hop into this car game you gotta have money stuff happens especially when you try to go fast but we just hit 75,000 miles Woo! uh damn <laughs> but anyways man please like comment subscribe we need at least uh who's gonna say 50 likes let's go down there Let's get 50 likes, gang. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't. Go share this video. Share it with your friends. You know what I'm saying? If you in the 300 crew and a Mopar or a first gen, go share it to them. Let them know. So, if you buy this car, you will better know what you're getting yourself into. You get what I'm saying? So, help them out. But, man, once again, it's your boy eBay. Shot it, man. We out of here. Thanks for all the love and support, man. Happy holidays. And we got them. I ain't into the cap and let's keep it real He could have held us man down, he took a deal That's why I can't show nobody how we live I got the news from my sister, gave me chills Gang off y'all pills, fucking up parties, it's just a thrill He popped his hands and I dog itching to do a drill